Hello everybody, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Shmriti. I really don't know how to start this video, but if you have watched my previous video, the first footage is of me wearing the same t-shirt telling you the same exact thing that I'm going to tell you and that is our Lysenier examination has finally been rescheduled and we are having it finally. If you don't know what happened was we were about to have our Lysenier examination on Asar but it just got cancelled because of the covid cases that was going on and the lockdown and all that stuff so yeah so today it got published that our licensure examination is going to be on bhadra 19 and today is shawan 7 so we have one month from shawan 10 to bhadra 7 to fill up the form you know for taking the licensure examination but i wanted to do it early however my transcript you know the transcript the certificate that comes from the university has not yet arrived so i'm waiting on that and for the time being let's say that we have only one month left for our exam so yeah it's gonna be another one month before exam preparation stuff thingy video i don't know how i'm gonna do it but yeah so i've been trying to make this covid 19 timeline for a very long time now and look at the mess that i've made so i finally made one impairment impairment for abnormal body structure or alterations is done today is 8th of shawan that is friday and i have scheduled my study plan for the last month like the month before my exam so as you can see i've color coordinated the subjects that i want to study on certain days and stuff uh, if you want the details um comment down below if you want how i studied and i will make a separate video for you on that on friday and saturday i'm going to study community health because community health itself is not a very long chapter and it does have things that i've already studied in my nursing school so i just need to revise it and i am going through the points that are written in the book and then making notes of certain things that i might need to remember as well as those topics or those points that have been asked over and over again and then i'm going to do the question hi guys today is 13 of shavan and it has been one week since the routine came out and i was planning on doing adult health nursing this week however i feel sick for straight three days so i've not studied yet and i wanted to study today well i think med third is the most difficult one there are so many system and under that system there are so many disease portion i only have 35 days i believe for now how am i gonna do it hello today is july 31st shawan 16 and i've not been studying very frank i have not been studying well to be honest i was quite busy with some work some household work some household chores and also i've been uploading and editing a lot of youtube videos that is taking my whole day today is saturday and from tomorrow onwards i might study seriously tonight i'm just gonna edit another video it is the third one in a row and i'm quite tired to be honest but see you when i actually study i am having a little bit of problem with my eyes i think my power has changed so i need to go and do a checkup of my eyes as well but to talk about the study update i think i'm going to do the question of the adult nursing the only disadvantage is that this does not have a rationale so we will never know why the answer is the answer so i need to go through that as well if there are confusion on some questions oops Hello everybody, today is 8th of August and it is 8 p.m. And I have an update for you all that I have done a quick review of the adult health and nursing. So it includes all the system and I've gone through each and every disease portion. And I've also done the questions or practice the question from CVS, respiratory, nervous, um, stress and crisis and oncology. Now I'm left with the GI and urinary and 
I don't know, musculoskeleton and all. So yeah, so tonight I am going to do that and finish the other health nursing part one of my review. That is what I'm gonna do tonight. I am bound to finish the adult health nursing to tonight. And for that I have I have the study playlist sort of study with me video going on with some muted loafy bits. I'm actually a day and a two late from starting another you know another subject but that's fine. I'm gonna complete this today and from tomorrow onwards I am going to do a rapid fire round of childhood nursing so yeah that's my plan and for some time being I am quite I don't know what my progress is like but I have to like you know go through again and again the same thing so that I can know how well I've done but that's that <laughs> Coffees are supposed to make you stay alive, but I'm gonna fall asleep. <sighs> Hello everybody. Did you know that the countdown has already started? Today is 30th of Shavan. Now we only have 20 days left for our exam, which is insane. In here. I have all the years, like the question sets and all the marks that I've obtained so far. And if I've repeated the sets, I'm gonna, like, you know, compare my marks. This is a really very helpful tip for you all as well. And the next thing is, I have already completed adult health nursing, I've already completed mental mental i've already completed mental health nursing today i'm gonna have some discussions with my friends on questions um we can't meet i mean we can but but we are gonna do the discussions online hello people so because now we only have 20 days for our exam uh, the most important and crucial thing that i have been doing from my school year in order to study is to like you know schedule the final thing when it is the last 15 to 20 days so first i will list out all the subjects and then i will put out which is like the most hardest or which is, which carries the most marks because i have seven days sorry seven subjects for 15 days i might schedule you know one subject for two days Good morning, everybody. It has been a while since I've did a proper vlog. I have this to-do list or task list sort of thing. So I'm going to prioritize whatever I'm reading today right here. So we have some calculations, sites and degrees for injection, blood products or fluid products, AVGs and some conditions like snake bites, burns and all that stuff. So I'm going to go th quickly through that. And then I might start practicing questions. Hello, hello. Today is 21st of August and it is Padra 5. A very big update that I have already filled up my form for the Lycenaire examination. I went to the college and got my transcript, my mark sheet on all the certificates needed and then I came home and then you know filled up my form and now the documents are under review. However, it has been two days or three days and the mail has not yet come if it is either verified or not so today is well let me let me grab my calendar so today is saturday bhadra 5 now i had this calendar thing going on from uh, last month so as you can see uh, from our from the month of shravan i had this thing going on crossing all the days and from the time when my uh, routine came out so we have Shavan gone and now as you can see today is Saturday so two days have already gone so now I only have 14 days exactly left or let's say 13 because I do not count the exam day so 
I have already done two subjects, completed the review, completed the questions also and about the next topic, I have actually not started it. I mean, I have started and reviewed it a little bit, but I am still left with the questions. So I have to do that. Half of the day have already gone and I only have half of the day left. So I have a lot of things on my plate right now. I have to do the questions. Also, I've not been doing the uh, yearly sets. So I have to go up and do it as well. Well, it would be my third round, I believe. So I have to do that as well. And then uh, from next week, I'm going to go with the lesser subjects like, you know, the one that carries less marks my friends have been asking me some questions and i've been helping them out and they have been helping me out i also asked my sister and uh, my brother-in-law uh, for the questions we just discussed it over our q a session so it is really fun to know the answer and discuss the question uh, which is really helpful so you know they are like a study group or study partners so yeah that's interesting and on monday which is on 7th of padra i have to go to a workshop it is some critical care based training so that's that hi guys so today is 27th of august that is 11th of padra now we only have um seven days left i believe for exam because i do not count the exam day so it is ju just seven days now which is quite terrifying i have not been uh, vlogging that much however i have already finished all the subject wise questions and now what i've planned for for the last week or just seven days is that today i will be doing the leftovers so the leftovers include mental health nursing geriatric nursing and covid19 questions so i will be going through that as well as solving some of the past sets that i've already done to see if i do remember it or not because it is very much essential to do a revision to recall all the information so that is what i'm doing today so the whole thing so the whole plan for the whole week is to just go through and revise everything so i'll be going through all the uh subjects once again and taking it on the book for the final review session as well as doing all the past questions also and going through all my notes so whatever i have you know put on the note i'm gonna go through and revise it in a very hasty manner i would like to say it was it is not going to be in detail but i'm just going to go through and skim through that so that is my plan for the week and i really don't know if i will be filming um or recording myself or not for this week but that is my general plan so yeah that will be my general thing for the week and i think this is it for the video i'm gonna stop vlogging here but i really don't know but this is what my preparation went like and if you want in detail how i prepared what are the plans or schedules that i had for all these months then i will make it in a separate video for you guys and i hope you guys enjoyed watching my journey um, you know, I procrastinated a lot, but I did what I had to do as well. So yes, life. So yes, it has been a roller coaster of emotions, a roller coaster of effort. But we made it. The day has finally come now. So that is it. <laughs> it's crazy.